All right, everybody, welcome back. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. Sorry, last week I missed a couple days. I had some things I had to take care of. Anyways, I'm back this week for some brand new videos, so hopefully you guys will enjoy them. So today I am gonna be going over the seven piece magnetic tip hollow shaft nut driver set. Had these on the wall for a while and I wanna open them up, check them out, and I can't wait to use them soon. Um, and I'll explain to you why I got these probably in a different video, but let's go ahead and check these out and I will give you guys my thoughts on it. Let's go ahead and start pulling these out. All right, so starting out, let's just go ahead and check these out. As you can see, they are made in the USA, so these look like they're gonna be some quality tools. Um, there are some other nut drivers that Klein makes that are foreign made, I believe, and I believe that the magnets fall out of them. Um, I've heard several bad reports of other Klein um, nut drivers, so I stayed away from those, not because they're made in a different country, but just because that they keep falling apart. So I want to avoid those. Um, as you can see, I have my standard nut driver over here. Um, and this, these are both 316s right here. Obviously the new ones are magnetic. Um, as you can see, they are a lot longer right here. So these are magnetic with the hollow shaft on obviously the bigger ones and small ones aren't gonna be very hollow. So it does look like there's some kind of white glue circle in here or some kind of um, something holding in the magnet, which is in the middle obviously. So I'm not sure if these are gonna have problems down the road. Um, I don't know if just it's a fault with all the magnetic tips. If they keep falling out, I obviously haven't used these yet, but so hopefully these don't have any problems. Um, if they do, I can always exchange them for something new or hopefully return them down the line. But um, obviously I'm hoping that they don't because obviously I want to use them. Um, I have a specific purpose in mind for these. Um, so hopefully the magnets don't fall out. Um, but they do obviously look like a normal nut driver. They obviously look like um, any type of climb tool basically. Um, they have the really nice handle grips, um, nice and rubber. So you have everything nice and labeled back here. This is the 716th, obviously they're a magnetic tip. Um, and then obviously they're a little bit longer than the uh, normal ones. Um, and then they do have the hollow shaft inside. So if you want to use these on like uh, all thread or something like that, um, you can, um, but they do not have any holes. Don't get these confused with the um, hollow shafts that have the holes in the back. Those are different ones that have a lot of problems. I was actually gonna get those at first, but I actually steered into these ones because I heard that they have a lot less problems or I haven't heard any problems of these ones specifically. But the other ones, if you were using a all thread or something like that, in this scenario right here, you could basically put the all thread through the whole screwdriver and keep screwing in the nut um, if you are using it in that scenario. In this scenario with this hollow nut driver, obviously the all thread is going to bottom out in between the end of the shaft right here or inside the screwdriver yellow part right here. Um, but if you get the other kinds, then they can go all the way through. Um, so you can screw them in as far as you want, um, but then you just have to worry about the magnets falling out, um, which is what you don't want because you don't want your tools falling apart. This one looks like it's slightly deformed or something. I'm not sure, there's kind of like some divots some type of weird rigid rigid surface on the yellow part of that one. All the other ones look pretty good except for that one. That one has a little bit of this thing as well. I'm not sure what that's about. So I'll explain to you guys what my specific use for these are going to be in a different video. Um, it's for a safety reason and I'll explain to you uh, why. And anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this. All right, guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you so much for stopping by. I appreciate it. As always, if you enjoyed, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. I'd appreciate it. It would help the channel out. And I would love to see you guys back in the next video. Don't forget, I have tons of videos on my channel. So check those out. Over 1,400 videos. 1,450 to be exact. Well, 1,451 now. So anyways, hopefully you guys check out some of my other videos. Hopefully those help you out as well. And share my channel if you guys think someone else might enjoy it. Check down below in the description for anything else. And hit the notification bell if you want to be notified when I upload or do live streams. Thanks guys so much. God bless. Have an awesome rest of your day. Peace out.